In the world of celebrity drama, few moments cause as much stir as when subtle jabs and cryptic social media posts turn into headline-grabbing exchanges. This latest incident between singer and actress Tiana Taylor and sports analyst Kayla Nicole, known for her past relationship with NFL superstar Travis Kelsey, has taken center stage, sparking discussions across social media platforms and the entertainment world alike. What initially appeared to be a casual comment quickly snowballed into a public feud, with fans and observers trying to decode the underlying tensions. It all started when Kayla Nicole, during an appearance on Angel Reese's podcast, Unapologetically Angel, made an offhand remark about dressing up as Tiana Taylor for Halloween. While on the surface, it seemed like an innocent nod to Taylor's iconic style, the context in which the comment was made hinted at something deeper. Nicole referenced her previous relationship with former NBA player Iman Shumpert, who is married to Taylor, in a way that left some wondering whether the comment was a lighthearted joke or a subtle dig at the singer. As reported by Page Six, Tayana Taylor didn't take the remark lightly. While Nicole didn't directly insult Taylor, the suggestion that she would dress as Taylor for Halloween, paired with the implication of her connection to Shumpert, was enough to raise eyebrows. To those familiar with the intertwined relationships in the world of celebrity, this comment seemed to touch a nerve, particularly given that Nicole and Shumpert's paths had crossed in the past. Tiana Taylor, never one to shy away from addressing drama, head on, responded in a way that only a savvy celebrity could, through the art of social media. Instead of directly confronting Nicole's comment, Taylor posted a story to her Instagram featuring Taylor Swift's 2014 hit, Shake It Off a song famously associated with brushing off criticism and negativity. The message behind Taylor's choice of song was clear. She was telling Nicole, and perhaps the public, that she wasn't going to let the comment rattle her. However, the timing and context of her post made it evident that it was more than just a casual share. It was a deliberate response to Nicole's thinly veiled jab. But the saga didn't end there. Tiana Taylor, who is known for being direct and unapologetic in her approach, followed up her Instagram post with some pointed comments of her own. According to reports, she remarked that Nicole's words were carefully chosen, fully aware of the buzz they would create. Most importantly, she knew people would dig, Taylor reportedly said, expressing her frustration over the subtle shade that Nicole had thrown. In her view, Nicole's reference to dressing up as her was more than just a Halloween costume idea. It was a calculated move meant to reignite the conversation about her past relationship with Shumpert. For Taylor, the entire situation seemed to highlight the ongoing pressures and scrutiny faced by celebrities when it comes to their personal relationships. Her frustration was palpable as she pointed out how even a seemingly innocuous comment could quickly be spun into something more sensational. It's a reminder that, in the world of celebrity, no comment is made without careful consideration of the potential impact, and no one is truly off limits when it comes to public discourse. Kayla Nicole, for her part, has yet to make a direct response to Taylor's subtle clapback, but the situation has sparked widespread discussion on social media, with fans taking sides and debating the motivations behind both women's actions. Was Nicole's comment truly intended to stir the pot, or was it just a case of an offhand remark being taken out of context? And was Taylor right to respond with such a public, albeit indirect, message? The incident also brings into focus the ways in which celebrities use social media to navigate their feuds. While Taylor's choice to post Shake It Off may seem like a lighthearted response, it is emblematic of the strategic ways in which public figures manage their image. Rather than engaging in a direct war of words, Taylor opted for a more sophisticated approach, using a popular song to convey her message while leaving room for interpretation. It's a move that allows her to maintain control over the narrative without being seen as overly confrontational. At its core, this feud between Tiana Taylor and Kayla Nicole is about more than just a Halloween costume suggestion. It's about the delicate balance of power, perception, and reputation in the world of celebrity. Both women are well aware of how their words and actions are dissected by fans and the media, and both seem to be playing a calculated game of chess as they navigate the fallout from their recent exchanges. As the drama unfolds, it's clear that this isn't just a simple case of a celebrity misunderstanding. It's a reflection of the complexities that come with fame, where even the most casual comments can carry significant weight, and where social media becomes both a battleground and a stage for public figures to assert their dominance. While it remains to be seen whether Nicole will address Taylor's response or whether the feud will fizzle out, one thing is certain. 
When it comes to the world of celebrity status, no comment goes unnoticed, and no jab is too small to cause a stir. The tension between Tiana Taylor and Kayla Nicole escalated when Taylor directly accused Nicole of being disrespectful and attempting to diminish her accomplishments with careless remarks. What began as an offhand comment during an interview quickly transformed into a much larger issue, one that Taylor took to heart. For Taylor, it wasn't just about a flippant Halloween costume suggestion. It was about the deeper implications of Nicole's words, particularly when they seemed to trivialize her personal and professional achievements. Taylor made it clear that when it comes to relationships and personal history, especially in the world of fame, words hold significant weight. And in her view, Nicole's choice of words did more than just poke fun. They threatened to belittle her success and her standing in the public eye. What stood out most to Taylor was the timing and tone of Nicole's remarks. As someone who has built a multifaceted career in music, acting, and fashion, Tiana Taylor has earned her place in the spotlight. So when Nicole, who is best known for her relationship with NFL star Travis Kelsey, made a comment referencing Taylor's marriage to former NBA player Iman Shumpert, it struck a nerve. For Taylor, the remark seemed not only unnecessary, but also a subtle attempt to undermine her, a move that Taylor was not going to let slide. Much to the anticipation of fans and followers of both women, Taylor didn't stop at privately stewing over the perceived insult. She decided to confront Nicole's attitude head on, and the drama spilled onto social media, where millions of fans eagerly watched the fallout. The tension reached new heights when Taylor took to her podcast and elaborated on her grievances with Nicole, further fueling the flames of their public feud. On her podcast, Taylor didn't hold back as she addressed the issue with candor and passion. She expressed her disappointment in Nicole's behavior, making it clear that her remarks were not only hurtful, but completely out of line. Her choice of words were very distasteful and uncalled for, Taylor stated, explaining that she was genuinely taken aback by how Nicole had chosen to speak about her, especially given their tenuous connection through Shumpert. In Taylor's eyes, it wasn't just a harmless joke. It was an attempt to reduce her to a footnote in someone else's story. The fact that Nicole had once dressed as Taylor for Halloween added an extra layer of irony to the situation, as it underscored how Nicole, in some ways, had modeled herself after the very person she was now trying to belittle. Taylor's response wasn't just a clapback to Nicole's comment. It was a broader commentary on the ways in which women, particularly in the entertainment industry, can sometimes tear each other down instead of lifting each other up. Taylor's frustration resonated with many of her fans, especially women, who recognize the underlying message in her words, that there is enough room for everyone to succeed, and petty rivalries only serve to perpetuate negativity and competition among women. In her podcast comments, Taylor made a powerful statement about the importance of solidarity, especially among women who have faced the same struggles in a cutthroat industry. She emphasized that instead of engaging in snide remarks or veiled insults, women in the public eye should be celebrating each other's accomplishments. For Taylor, Nicole's comments weren't just a personal attack. They were indicative of a larger issue in the celebrity world, where women are often pitted against one another for the sake of entertainment. Taylor's response aimed to challenge that dynamic, reminding her audience that women are stronger when they stand together, rather than when they attempt to undermine each other's successes. While Taylor's candid and passionate response certainly made headlines, it also sparked an important conversation among her followers about the impact of words, particularly when they come from someone in a position of influence. For many of her fans, Taylor's decision to call out Nicole wasn't just about defending herself. It was about defending the notion that every woman's success deserves to be respected, regardless of her personal connections or her past. As the drama between Taylor and Nicole unfolded, it became clear that this was more than just a fleeting social media spat. It was a public display of the challenges that come with navigating fame, especially for women who are constantly under scrutiny. In an industry where success can often feel competitive, Taylor's insistence on holding Nicole accountable for her words was a reminder that fame should not be a free pass to tear others down. Beyond the gossip and social media frenzy, Taylor's response tapped into a deeper issue of how public figures, particularly women, are expected to handle criticism and rivalry. Her choice to address the situation with both grace and firmness reflected her commitment to upholding her values and her belief in solidarity. Rather than engage in a back and forth war of words, Taylor used her platform to make a statement about the importance of mutual respect, something that transcends celebrity drama, 
and speaks to the way women interact with each other in all walks of life. The incident also revealed how social media has become a stage for real-time confrontations, allowing celebrities to air their grievances directly to their audience. In this case, Taylor's response to Nicole's comment played out in front of millions of followers, creating a ripple effect that spread far beyond their initial exchange. Fans weighed in, taking sides, debating the merits of each woman's actions, and fueling the ongoing narrative about female rivalry in the entertainment industry. Following the public feud and social media uproar, Kayla Nicole has finally broken her silence, offering a response that attempts to bring clarity and closure to the situation. In a post on X, formerly known as Twitter, Nicole addressed the backlash, stating, Sometimes I'm asked about my personal life and decide to share the lessons I've learned. Her words appeared to be an attempt to distance herself from the drama, highlighting a desire for understanding and growth rather than engaging in further conflict. However, her attempt at stepping away from the feud came across as somewhat contradictory, as not long after, she posted an Instagram video with Beyonce's empowering anthem Formation playing in the background, suggesting that Nicole might not be as indifferent to the situation as she initially portrayed. Nicole's response on X seemed, at first glance, to focus on maturity and personal development by framing her remarks as a reflection on past experiences and the lessons she's learned she hinted at a more introspective approach to handling the scrutiny and controversy surrounding her. The language she used in her post suggested that she wasn't looking to fan the flames of the feud with Tiana Taylor, but rather to move forward, taking with her the wisdom she has gained from navigating public relationships and the spotlight. Yet, despite her seemingly calm and measured response, the accompanying Instagram video set to Beyonce's formation sent a very different message. Formation is a song known for its themes of empowerment, confidence, and resilience, with Beyonce's lyrics encouraging women to stand strong, celebrate their achievements, and unapologetically take control of their narratives. By choosing this song as the backdrop to her video, Nicole appeared to signal that she wasn't phased by the drama with Taylor and was, in fact, embracing her power in the situation. The video seemed to communicate that Nicole was unbothered by the criticism and was fully capable of standing her ground, giving fans and observers mixed signals about where she truly stood on the issue. This dramatic exchange between Nicole and Taylor is not just about their individual responses, but also touches on their shared history, which adds layers of complexity to the narrative. Tiana Taylor and Amon Shumpert were married from 2016 to 2023, a relationship that was closely followed by fans and the media. Their marriage was often celebrated as a strong partnership, with both Taylor and Shumpert appearing to support each other's careers and personal endeavors. However, the dissolution of their marriage earlier in 2023 marked the end of what many had considered a power couple. For Taylor, the recent jabs from Nicole, which referenced her marriage to Shumpert, hit particularly close to home given the public nature of their relationship and its eventual end. On the other side of the equation is Kayla Nicole, who had her own high-profile relationship with NFL star Travis Kelsey. Nicole and Kelsey's on and off relationship was widely covered in the media, with fans closely following their ups and downs. While the details of their split remained somewhat private, the public nature of their relationship left Nicole in a similar position to Taylor. Both women have had to navigate the pressures and challenges that come with being in the public eye while dealing with personal heartaches. The intersection of these women's lives through their relationships, breakups, and shared experiences of fame only serves to make their recent feud all the more intriguing. Both Taylor and Nicole are well-versed in the complexities of living their personal lives on a public stage, and their pasts have undoubtedly shaped how they respond to conflict and criticism today. The fact that Nicole's comment, made during a podcast interview, touched on a subject as sensitive as Taylor's marriage to Shumpert, shows just how easily past relationships and personal histories can become entangled in public drama. The narrative surrounding these two women is not just about petty rivalries. It's about how their personal lives have become intertwined in the public consciousness, creating a storyline that is far more complicated than a simple back and forth exchange. Both Taylor and Nicole have had to contend with the intense scrutiny that comes with being involved in high profile relationships and the way they choose to handle the fallout from their personal lives inevitably shapes their public personas. For Tiana Taylor, the issue was not just about Nicole's Halloween costume comment, but about the larger context in which her marriage to Shumpert was referenced. Having built her career as a successful musician, actress, and fashion icon, Taylor has worked hard to establish herself as a powerhouse in her own right. 
any suggestion that her accomplishments or public standing are tied solely to her personal relationships, particularly with Shumpert, is bound to touch a nerve. Her response, which involved calling out Nicole's words as distasteful and uncalled for, was a way for Taylor to reclaim her narrative and ensure that her legacy is not reduced to her role as Shumpert's ex-wife. For Nicole, however, the situation appears more complex. Her initial remarks seemed casual enough, but the subsequent reaction from Taylor and fans likely took her by surprise. In attempting to clarify her comments with her ex-post, Nicole framed the discussion around personal growth and learning from past mistakes. Yet her choice to share the formation video, which projects confidence and defiance, seemed to undercut her earlier message of introspection and humility. It left many wondering whether Nicole was genuinely trying to step away from the drama or if she was subtly asserting her own dominance in the situation. As the dust settles, it's clear that this exchange is far from just a fleeting social media spat. It highlights the broader themes of how women in the public eye navigate their personal and professional identities, especially when their pasts are so deeply entangled with those of other high profile figures. Both Taylor and Nicole have had to deal with the repercussions of their past relationships playing out in the media, and both are now trying to forge their own paths amid the ongoing public interest in their personal lives. This feud, while initially sparked by a seemingly offhand comment, has evolved into a much deeper exploration of how celebrity women handle conflict, rivalries, and public scrutiny. It reflects the pressures they face not only to maintain their personal brand, but also to assert their independence and agency in a world that is quick to reduce them to their past relationships. Whether Nicole intended to stir the pot or not, her comment about dressing as Taylor for Halloween opened up old wounds and forced both women to confront the complex intersection of fame, relationships, and public perception. In summary, the exchange between Tiana Taylor and Kayla Nicole highlights the intricate, often complicated dynamics of celebrity relationships and the heavy burden that public figures carry as they navigate both past choices and present actions. What began as an offhand comment from Nicole quickly spiraled into a public dispute that opened up broader conversations about respect, rivalry, and the unique pressures that come with fame. The incident serves as a microcosm of the struggles women in the spotlight face constantly having their lives dissected, their relationships scrutinized, and their words weighed far beyond what most of us experience in our daily lives. At its core, this exchange between Taylor and Nicole is about more than just a clash of egos. It's a reflection of how intertwined personal histories and public personas have become in the age of social media, with platforms like Instagram and X, formerly Twitter, amplifying every comment and every reaction. The fallout from a single remark can be swift and intense, as both women learned firsthand. Celebrity feuds like this one show us how fragile public perception can be, and how a seemingly small spark can ignite widespread debate and engagement, drawing in fans, fellow entertainers, and media outlets alike. For Tiana Taylor, the entire situation speaks to a larger issue of respect and recognition for the work she has put into building her career. As a multi-talented artist who has earned acclaim in music, acting, and fashion, Taylor is keenly aware of the challenges that come with being in the public eye, particularly the way her accomplishments can be overshadowed by her personal relationships. Taylor's decision to respond both publicly and through her podcast underscored the power of words, especially when spoken by influential figures with large followings. Her frustration was palpable as she addressed Nicole's remarks, calling them distasteful and uncalled for, and pointing out how even seemingly lighthearted comments can carry deeper implications. Taylor's response was more than just a defense of her reputation. It was a call for solidarity among women, a reminder that in an industry that so often pits women against one another, it's more important than ever to uplift rather than tear down. On the other side, Kayla Nicole's response also spoke volumes about how she sees herself in the public sphere. By posting on X that she sometimes shares the lessons she has learned from her personal life, Nicole aimed to distance herself from the controversy, implying that her comments were made with good intentions. Yet the video she posted on Instagram, set to Beyonce's formation, seemed to send a different message altogether. The song, which celebrates empowerment and self-confidence, suggested that Nicole wasn't backing down from the situation. In fact, she was embracing her role as someone who won't be easily shaken by public criticism. The mix signals from Nicole, on the one hand, claiming personal growth and introspection, and on the other, exuding confidence and defiance, left fans and observers divided. Some saw her initial comment as an innocent mistake that was blown out of proportion, 
while others interpreted her actions as a subtle form of shade directed at Taylor. Regardless of her intentions, Nicole's response illustrates the fine line that public figures must walk between explaining themselves and standing their ground, especially when their words and actions are scrutinized by millions. This drama also serves as a reminder of the challenges that arise when celebrity relationships, past and present, become entangled in public discourse. Tayana Taylor's marriage to Shumpert, which lasted from 2016 to 2023, was widely admired, with the couple often seen as a model of love and partnership. The public nature of their relationship meant that when they separated, the world took notice, and any comments about their personal lives, like Nicole's Halloween reference, were bound to hit a nerve. Meanwhile, Nicole's own high-profile relationship with NFL player Travis Kelsey brought her into the spotlight adding another layer of complexity to her public persona. As these two women's lives continue to intersect, the tension between them highlights how past relationships can cast long shadows, particularly when fame is involved. In many ways, both Taylor and Nicole have had to contend with the same pressures, living out their personal lives in front of an audience eager for drama and quick to judge. This feud, while rooted in a specific comment, taps into the broader narrative of how women are often defined by the men they've been involved with and how difficult it can be to carve out an identity that is separate from those relationships. Beyond the immediate fallout of their exchange, the incident speaks to the larger cultural dynamics at play when it comes to female rivalry and solidarity in the entertainment industry. The public loves a good celebrity feud, but Taylor's emphasis on the importance of supporting other women sheds light on the damage these rivalries can cause. In an industry that too often thrives on conflict, Taylor's call for unity challenges the very framework of how we expect women in the spotlight to behave. Rather than competing for attention or tearing each other down, Taylor's message is one of mutual respect and empowerment, even if her response to Nicole's comment was sharp. The media too plays a role in amplifying these conflicts, turning what might have been a private disagreement into a public spectacle. In an age where celebrity news cycles are fueled by social media posts and podcast sound bites, every word and every reaction becomes fodder for endless analysis. This constant scrutiny makes it all the more difficult for celebrities to control their own narratives, forcing them to respond in real time or risk letting the story spiral out of their hands. As fans, entertainers, and media figures continue to engage with this story, it becomes clear that the drama between Tiana Taylor and Kayla Nicole is about more than just a few snide comments. It's a reflection of the pressures placed on women in the entertainment world to navigate personal and professional rivalries while maintaining their public image. The incident serves as a cautionary tale about the power of words and the importance of being mindful of how we speak about others, particularly when those words have the potential to reopen old wounds.